welcome back everyone. Toysh is here and a very happy San Diego Comic-Con 2024 to you all. Not to worry, we will be having full coverage of everything going on at Comic-Con this year. But wouldn't you know it, it's my 30th year going to San Diego Comic-Con officially. Did all the math. I thought last year was 30. This, without a doubt, this is the 30th year. But only my 8th year going under Toysh's. But... NECA Toys was nice enough. They sent over all their brand new STCC 2024 exclusives. And of course, we're going to start things off proper with an early look at their Captain Impressive action figure. Now, for those of you out there who are thoroughly confused, I see you. There's a few. This hails from Jim Henson's Dinosaurs, of which NECA Toys is, of course, making action figures for. In the episode entitled Earl, Don't Be a Hero, we see the birth of the hero Captain Impressive, a.k.a. Earl Sinclair, who has taken a job dumping nuclear waste into the river. And of course, he has to fall into said river and promptly starts wearing a mask and a costume because, yes, we officially jump the shark because Earl now has superpowers. No joke. This is not a dream episode. This is not a what if episode. Earl Sinclair, the dinosaur, gets superpowers. And all of this is basically to impress baby Sinclair because he idolizes another action figure superhero. Wouldn't you know it, Earl Sinclair is found out by his boss and we say so takes control of the Captain Impressive name and forces Earl to then sell all these terribly dangerous products to children and laughs ensue. It's bat poop crazy, but we now have an official Captain Impressive action figure to put on our dinosaur shelves. And I got to say, I love the artwork on this. That's very cool. I love seeing all of that. I love just the idea that this is the action figure being sold by We Say So Corp. That's just interesting. And it really does make for an interesting STCC exclusive. Gorgeous photos of the figure all over the box. Just love that it's part of the action fun hour. In the episode, they try to get Earl to do a kid's show as well. It, go watch the episode. It's on Disney+. Plus. It's very cool. Here's everyone involved with the creation of this figure. So thank you very much for that. And here's the barcode. But you're not going to need that. Because if you go to San Diego Comic-Con and you want this figure, you can grab it at the NECA booth. Or if you're not attending Comic-Con starting July 26th through the 28th, you can head over to the NECAstore.com and pick one up for yourself. So I'm telling you, don't kill yourself trying to grab this. If you want one, take your time, you'll get one. But in the meantime, this is going to be an absolute blast. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a nice hot cup of We Say So brand coffee. This is an early look at the brand new from the Dinosaurs toy line, Captain Impressive, the STCC 2024 exclusive by NECA Toys. And now flying in out of the packaging, we have Earl Sinclair as Captain Impressive, and here's everything taken out of the box. Go very easy when cutting those twisty ties. You don't want to cut any of the fabric, of which this figure has a lot of, and a lot of extra hands. So you get ungloved dinosaur hands. They're all painted nicely. Hands we have seen with Earl before, but then you get some pearlescent white gloved hands that go along with the gloves that you can actually remove if you'd like. So open hands, fisted hands, item holding hands, everything that you would need. Now you also get an extra unmasked Earl Sinclair head portrait, which is funny to say when talking about dinosaurs. I'm telling you, go, go watch the episode. And it's largely going to be the exact same head portrait that we've seen with the original release of Earl. This time around, it just has some extra paint, a little bit better painted overall, just a lot more crisp, which is nice to see. But yes, it will be the same exact expression. Now, no Captain Impressive action figure would be complete without his Captain Impressive trachea plug, ages 12 and older, which, yes, looks like the product straight from the episode. Although, this is very thin. It's a thin piece of plastic. I wish it was thicker or just something that was glued or as fixed to something plastic because unfortunately it's way too thin for the grip that Earl has. So you're going to have to kind of figure it out, maybe stick it on something, put another piece of paper in with his grip. Don't want to have to do that, but I'm happy to say that if you have baby Sinclair, 
he will hold it, or better yet, you can just prop it up on his high chair. So yes, in that sense, it definitely works. Again, it's something that he wanted in the episode. Uh, hopefully, Earl signed it, but that looks good. That looks better. The actual action figure of Earl Sinclair as Captain Impressive is quite impressive, I will say. It's going to be the same exact body. They've just put all kinds of cloth goods all over him, which is awesome. And again, it's fun for an SDCC exclusive, but it's largely going to be the same exact Earl, of which now this is the third Earl we've gotten. But this, technically, you could say, is a different character. The head portrait has the white mask. I like that. His mouth is open. Although I will say, as my other dinosaur videos, I wish that you could articulate the mouth. It had a joint in there. He's got the Captain Impressive shield as well as a division of We Say So Corp logo. That is funny. That's all painted on there. He's got his belts, enough to make a Rob Liefeld cry, and he's got... Again, the same exact articulation. Everything moves. The cloth goods. He's got peg holes on the bottom of his feet. The cloth goods don't hinder any of the articulation, which is nice. You're not going to get any hindrance, really, in the neck articulation. And I like that this piece right here is a separate piece to the entire figure. So you pop the head off, you can slip everything off. But it really is his cape, which is essentially Earl's shirt as a cape, but it has a bendy wire in there. It's not a really thick bendy wire. In fact, I didn't even notice it until I started. I was like, oh yeah, there's a bendy wire in there. So it's very thin, but it gets the job done. And for that alone, I totally dig the cape. That's a very cool to have that element with a bendy wire in it. The articulation, again, you won't have to worry too much about the cloth. You just kind of have to worry about figuring out the articulation because you cannot see it. So again, same exact. You have the gloves, you'll have the wrists, everything spins, single joints. Just don't force anything. And I didn't run into any problem with the material getting caught in the joint, but don't raise it up too high. You don't want to split the seams, anything like that. So learn it before you go crazy. Same thing with the knees, the legs, all that jazz. But again, very, we'll say minimal in terms of the articulation, but suitable for a figure that is Earl Sinclair, the dinosaur. And then you have the segmented tail, the feet. Yeah, everything just looks good. He just looks good and he has a waist crunch that kind of works. So again, it's just a fun STCC exclusive for the old dinosaur shelf. Now, to see these two in action, you have the original release of Earl Sinclair. Then you have Captain Impressive, of which there is also We Say So Corp. Errol Sinclair hitting store shelves now as we speak. I haven't seen him just yet. But yes, same exact figure, except one's wearing cloth goods. In terms of pairing him up with baby Sinclair. Now, this is where I think they could have had a little bit more fun with the accessories. Perhaps a removable white mask or just a white mask for Earl to hold. Or better yet, a Captain Impressive action figure for baby Sinclair to put on his high chair. Perhaps in later dinosaur releases, we will see that. But that would have been the perfect accessory for a Captain Impressive action figure. Now, one thing that's kind of funny in recent years, we've had the Jurassic League and NECA Toys did do their own DC Comics action figures along with Predator and Alien that were SDC exclusives some years back. But it's fun to see all of these paired up. Batman, Earl Sinclair as Captain Impressive, Superman, Hal Jordan. It's a lot of fun. You'll have a lot of fun with this figure if you're a Dinosaurs fan. So that will wrap it up for my early look at the brand new NECA Toys SDCC 2024 exclusive Earl Sinclair as Captain Impressive from the Jim Henson's dinosaurs line. And again, thank you to my friends over at NECA Toys for setting this out for the purposes of this video. Definitely give it a watch. Always, as I say, before you buy, make sure it's something you absolutely want. There's so much good stuff coming lately. It's getting harder and harder to get everything. So make those correct choices. If you're a dinosaurs fan, I give it the thumbs up. I think this is a lot of fun. It's actually one of my favorite SCCC exclusives. When I saw that release, I go, oh, yeah, that's what I want to see. And I want to see more dinosaurs figures. I want the entire family. I want Mr. Richfield. I want everybody. That would be the ideal sitch. So if you are interested in more dinosaurs, definitely let them know down in the comments below. And as always, I'm curious to know what you guys think about this new figure. 
And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, stay tuned. We got a lot more Negatoys STCC exclusives to cover before the pre-sale happens next week, July 26th through the 28th. And when we do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.